Hi, my name is Jason Seitz, and this is the 60 Second Study Session. Today's topic, hypoxic drive. A hypoxic drive is something that develops in a patient with chronic obstructive pulmonary disease. What happens is in these COPD patients, they have an inability to exhale enough CO2. They get CO2 trapped down in their lungs. Because of this, the buildup of CO2 over time, over years, causes their bodies to shift its acid base balance. And then what happens is they start to breathe not because of a buildup of CO2, because they always have that, they start to breathe because of a lack of oxygen. In my respiratory drive, I breathe because of a buildup of CO2. As my CO2 increases, my respiratory drive will increase as well. It's opposite with them. So what can happen in the field is if we give these patients oxygen and we saturate them up to 100%, we can actually snow their respiratory drive. Because they're getting plenty of oxygen, they have a lack of CO2, not a buildup of it, so their respiratory drive says, hey, we're good to go. We don't, we don't have a buildup anymore. I don't need to breathe. And we can actually, by giving them oxygen too much, cause them to stop breathing. So we want to avoid that. So always pay attention to your COPD patients and titrate to effect. Watch their oxygen saturations, but understand what's normal for them and don't go beyond what's normal for them. Don't try to always crank them up to 100% because you can get yourself in trouble. Thanks, we'll see you next time. Hey guys, if you enjoyed this video and you learned something from it, check out our test prep program for the NREMT at guardiantestprep.com.